I'm beardy. Bald and beardy. We're using the cook shack for its consistency. We're using the cook shack because uh, all we gotta do, and simplicity, all we gotta do is fill up the hopper with pellets, and then uh, we let it run all night long. We just set the temperature that we want to cook it at, and then we actually use a two-stage cook, so we set it at the first temperature, and then let it go into its hold cycle at the second temperature, uh, which was a little bit hotter, so we cooked at a lower temperature, and then a higher temperature, uh, and we didn't have to get up late at night to change the temperature. It, it goes on its own, so. Uh, we did that, and then uh, we can fit all of our all of our different products in here at the same time. So we're cooking simultaneously all of our different meats. So we're using an FEC 100. So how long have you been coming to the Cherokee Strip? Probably about 10 years. About 10 years. And what cookers are you using this year? I'm using a. Uh, Fiji 1000 grill and I cook my ribs and my chicken in it and I use a, a FEC 100 for my big meats, my pork butts and my briskets. Uh, they work great, they hold continuous temps, they're exactly the same every time. The weather doesn't bother them, no change, I can sleep all night. Uh, I used a wood smoker for years and uh, just the hassle of finding wood, stacking in the backyard, just a mess. Uh, this is a lot easier. You buy the pellets, I can box them up, have them sitting, they don't take up any room. The ash is none to clean out. Uh, they're just a great product. I'd recommend them to anybody. Well, my cook today, I'm hoping it does good. My brisket, I think it was a little bit on the tough side. But all in all, I think everything was great. Uh, the, the timing that you get down on these machines, you get consistent product every time. Uh, the only drawback that I had on that was the piece of meat I got to cook for my brisket. But the machines do their work. If I can do my part, it's the same every time. This is Ritz for her pleasure here in Ponca City, Oklahoma, out of Ponca City, Oklahoma. We're cooking on an FE100 and we finished up our chicken and our ribs on a CB Charbroiler 36. We choose the cook shacks because they're set and forget it. You don't have to sit a, spend a long, lot of time packing wood in your smoker. You just put the pellets in, you set the tent, and I haven't seen it drop or rise 10 degrees above what I set it at. I think our turn-ins went good. We've got a lot of people's choice, I think, people that have come by and really enjoyed our food. And I think our plates look very well. I, I'm very hopeful for the, jo the judges to uh, give us a good score. I think what sets us apart is we don't use a lot of store-bought store stuff. We made our own rubs, we made our own marinades, we made our own injections. 